Common Core Mathematics shifts. What will this mean and what will this mean we have to change about our instruction? The six shifts are focus, coherence, fluency, application, dual intensity, and deep understanding. Focus requires that we significantly narrow the scope of the content in each grade so that students more deeply experience that which remains. Students will spend more time thinking and working on fewer concepts and being able to understand the concepts as well as the process. To act, locate in your curriculum where each standard is taught. Lessons that don't tie to this standards erase. Coherence. Coherence is about making math make sense. Mathematics is not a list of disconnected tricks or mnemonics. This requires the connection of math focus across the grade levels. Each grade integrates prior grades, process, and methods. There needs to be a common thread through grades. To act, vertically align your standards. Know the material that is taught the year before and the year after. Fluency. The focus standard requires speed and accuracy in calculation. Students need to know the basic skills at the greater level of fluency. They need to practice with intensity and high volume. With understanding, students are able to manipulate more complex concepts. To get there, students need to be able to develop mental strategies that encourage flexible thinking. Deep understanding. Deep conceptual understanding of core content at each grade is critical for student success and sequential years. Students with conceptual understanding know more than isolated facts and methods. Teachers need to plan for progression of level of understanding and know what mastery and proficiency looks like. To act, incorporate more problem-based student-centered activities. Let the students become fluent with the mathematic practice. Application. Teachers at all levels need to identify opportunities for students to apply math concepts in real world situations. The process of modeling that includes choosing and using appropriate mathematics to analyze and understand situations. Act, incorporate more student-centered problems into the classroom. Start with tasks that will take less time and build their math task endurance throughout the year. Dual intensity. Students need to both practice and understand the mathematics. There is more than just a balance between these priorities in the class. Both are occurring with intensity. Students need to be practicing math skills with an intensity that results in fluency. To act, ensure you address mathematical procedures daily with practice and through problem solving and application. These are the six major shifts in curriculum instructions to align with the Common Core.